Hey guys, welcome to today's Vehicle Visionary. Today my friends at Red River Chevrolet have loaned me this 2020 Chevrolet Camaro RT for the day. And it features the 3LT performance package. And we're gonna touch on some of what that includes. And for a full list of what the 3LT package entails on this car, check out the description of the video after you've finished watching, of course. The exterior color on this car is called shock, and it's the perfect color name, or name for the color, I should say, for the exterior color on this car. It features a jet black interior and has a great combination between the two. And there is also the stripe kit that's on the hood and on the trunk and spoiler. And as you can see, like I said, here are the stripes. This is a special package that came with this particular model. This sets it apart nicely. And like I said, it's here on the hood and also on the trunk and continues on to the spoiler on the rear of the Camaro. Of course, you have the black front end, the black accents here, the grill, and you have the RS badge right here. Also, even though unfortunately I don't have a picture to show you, maybe I can find one on the internet somewhere, but this logo, the Chevrolet logo here actually lights up. So let's open the hood and we'll talk about what's under here. Okay guys, now that we've opened the hood and as you can see, you watch me regularly, you already see it. The very first thing I'm gonna bring up, I really like this when these cars are equipped as this one is, with the struts to help raise the hood and keep it up. Does it automatically, no stand to go hunting for and mount here in the hood. That makes it a whole lot easier. So this particular model of Camaro is motivated by a 3.6 liter V6, but don't let that deter you. Today's V6s are not hurting for horsepower. This particular model is putting out 335 horsepower and 285 foot pounds of torque. The gas mileage is an estimated 20 miles per gallon in the city and 30 miles per gallon out on the highway. And the zero to 60 is an impressive five seconds flat. And I say that the way I do because this engine is mated to a six speed manual transmission. Okay guys, a quick couple of notes about the side of the Camaro. Of course, you're gonna notice the black accents, the black mirror, the black trim around the windows and the painted silver wheels, 18 inches. And you're gonna notice that this shock exterior color carries over onto the brake calipers. So the Camaro badging here, of course. And here on the top, you'll find a sunroof on this particular model. And here on the doors, on the door handles, I should say, if you have the remote on your person, basically in your possession, passive entry to allow you to push that little button right there to lock and or unlock the doors. Here on the rear, you will notice the dual exhaust. And like I said, the exhaust note from the V6 under the hood of this Camaro is actually very impressive. You'll get to hear that on the test drive here shortly. And you do have 9.1 cubic feet of cargo space available here. You can maximize that when you lower the rear seats and increase your space that much more. So a reasonable amount of space for whatever needs you may have for your Camaro. Okay guys, let's talk interior. Here on the driver's side door, of course, you have everything you would expect to see, including driver's seat memory. There is a memory package with this particular model of car and steering wheel mounted controls, very nice steering wheel that is super comfortable here. You've got the flat bottom to make getting in and out of the car easier. If you didn't know, that's why the bottom of the steering wheel is flat. It's not just to look racy or anything like that. It just makes moving in and out of the car a little bit easier. Nice instrument cluster, very modern looking, and you can make some changes there as you see fit depending on what you want. You can have a digital speedometer if you want. You have a lot of different options there and part of the 3LT package on this Camaro is the heads up display. Something I really like a lot. And of course you have the infotainment screen here. Chevrolet's infotainment system is super easy to use. You've got all the common features there. Bluetooth, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, you can sync your phone that way. So everything that's in your phone is then available through the touch screen. But one thing I wanna show you here, I'm gonna actually show you how to do this. You can go into settings here, and from there, you're gonna go over here on the top of the screen to vehicle, and then down here to lighting. From there, you're gonna clip touch the ambient lighting option, 
And here are all of the options that you have for the interior lighting on this Camaro. There's quite a few there. And you can actually let it cycle through by simply pushing demo mode. And that way it just cycles through. You've got the lighting on the doors here and also here within the cup holders. You got dual cup holders there. So a nice little touch and depending on what kind of mood you're in or what you like, what color you like, you can make your selection from quite a wide range of options right there. Of course, you have heated and ventilated seats. Always nice to have those ventilated seats when you live in a place like Northwest Louisiana, where I am here today, where it's pretty warm. Nice feature there. Dual zone climate control, all the adjustments and amenities there that you would expect. And of course, if you're not familiar with it, the way you adjust the temperature is by turning the center vents. So depending on the driver or passenger's desires, that's how you're going to change the temperature. Of course, no shifter paddles needed here on the steering wheel. Six speed manual transmission with an electronic parking brake. So how about it guys? Why don't we hop out on the road and see how the Camaro performs? Like I said, is just so impressive. Let's give it a little bit of gas so you can hear it. It's definitely not lacking that performance sound here in the interior. I know there's a lot of people out there who are hardcore for the V8, and that's fine. But if you're looking for something that maybe will save you a little bit on gas, now depending on how heavy your right foot is, well, this might be what you would consider. Like I said, the steering wheel itself is very comfortable, and of course the handling of this Camaro is exceptional. It's a lot of fun to drive. The steering is nice and tight. Okay guys, we're coming up on one of the areas where I really enjoy testing out the cornering here, and I think we're about to have someone come blowing past us here, but since I'm in the dealership car, I'm really not too worried about it. Go ahead. <laughs> That's good for the video. <laughs> but anyway, we're just gonna go through the corner here and just test this out. Never mind the charger there. I couldn't keep up with him if I wanted to. He definitely has me on horsepower, but I've got him on color. <laughs> If you're the owner of that charger, tell me in the comments if you're watching this video. If this was my car, I wouldn't mind running you, but we're not going to do that in the dealership car, especially knowing that the dealership is watching. So, anyway guys, I'm cruising through these corners, cruising along pretty good here, having fun. The car is handling great, I mean just no body roll, no problems, no issues whatsoever. Just great, superb handling. Steering is nice and tight, highly responsive. Just an overall blast to drive. A lot of fun in the Camaro. I have to say, even though it's only a six cylinder underneath the hood, that 335 horsepower paired with the exhaust note that you get out of these exhaust tips on this car is very impressive. I'd like to tell my friends at Red River Chevrolet how much I appreciate them for letting me borrow this car for the day. Definitely a lot of fun to drive, especially with that six speed manual transmission. And thank you for taking the time to watch. I really appreciate your time, guys, and I will see you in my next video.